negative termination from negative. Okay, again. Cross the section where the correlation takes affected linearly. The cross the section where it's actually to charge. This means after action, the chakra of the density increase our status according to unit or company direction. The uniform status remains at level 1. Body armor and helmet are better within 10 minutes. The personal weapon status remains at average. Weapon on three. Magazine with ammunition. Round that chamber. Thanksgiving Day, 26th of November, 2020. About to go try to get some turkey from our de facto or the dining facility, as it's called. But there is a line. So, let's go check it out. Let's see if we can get a little grub. My goal is to get two big plates of food to go. So, let's go see what's cooking in the kitchen. Tune in later. And the lovely defect food from Grady and a care package from my baby. All right, here's a short video just to show you a little snow in the desert here in Bagram, Afghanistan. So it just started snowing today. And it is coming down. This is what it's like. It does snow in the desert. So I'm going back inside now. It's officially winter time. So we're going to have a, a white Christmas here in Bagram. So bye now. Well, now this is what it looks like walking in the snow and it's coming down see all covered in snow the time has started how's it going so, it is 
Winter time in the desert. So hello everyone. From beautiful, snowy, Bagram, Afghanistan. This is really the first snow of the year. It's just started snowing today. It's kind of dark here. I can't show too much. You understand? But uh, just finished a long 12 hour day. It's, what, what's the day? Uh, you forget the days. It's Monday, 14th of December. That's right. <sighs> Some big. Some big wet snowflakes. <clears throat> so it's been snowing pretty good for a couple hours. Can't wait to see what tomorrow morning looks like. So I am at my little tube. So we shall sign off now. I'm going in through the walls back there. The comfort of warmth of my room. So Bye everybody, thanks for watching. And here's a look at the <clears throat> wildlife on base. These big black and white birds and all over the place, pretty big birds. And you see uh, rabbits, it's mice that have this huge long tail where they're like a puffy ball at the end. You would see that. And like most military bases, you have a lot of wildlife on the base. It's protected. Beautiful mountains in the background, full of snow. Notice the lack of people. We lost a lot of folks who shipped out around this time. This was getting empty. Good morning, everybody. Today is the 25th of December, 2020. Merry Christmas to one and to all. Well, I'm headed out to starting my morning out as always. I'm going to breakfast. Morning, I have to drive to the other side of base because our dining facility facility closer to us closed early today. It's, it's understandable they're trying to get ready for the big Christmas meal. So, uh, so I'm going to the other side of base. Hopefully, uh, hopefully they have a normal. They have no more hours. We got a little more than 15 minutes to get there, 16 or 17 to be exact. See if I can get a little breakfast to start this day off. And of course, not get a speeding ticket because that would definitely cancel out breakfast. So. Here's my lovely Christmas meal. Everything was takeout. Because of COVID, we hadn't dined in in over a year. <clears throat> or right at about a year. But food was good. It's another shot of base, mountains, lack of personnel. Used to see hundreds of people walking around. Draw down, we Got rid of a lot of folks, lots of people. Cloud almost looked like a bomb blowing out. Happy New Year. So, coming to you live from beautiful Bagram, Afghanistan, I'd like to thank everybody for the nice wishes on my birthday. Appreciate it. Peace out. There be me 
march shortly before the party. Agram. This was pretty sad after a while, not too many people. Here is a rabbit that I see in between the connexes. I was surprised that they have rabbits there. I seen one the first day I got there in September 2019. is Bagram Warrior. So headed to the Arpad Yard to turn in all my gear. This will be a short little video. I'm a week out from leaving Afghanistan. to take all my stuff today so stay tuned for more bye now here is Grady Defat place I ate at for 20 months Let's look at our workplace get rid of some stuff at 1 in the morning take one last photo the on sea trees that I left behind. That's how we're building for a first. Well, this is my room. Been my room for 20 months. Standing on the, la the landing of the barracks. So, that was me. And this is my little room. What's left of it? Not a whole lot. Pretty empty. This is the little bathroom. Let's see if anybody's in here. This is what we have. And then we have a toilet. I'm watching the scene left by somebody else. And this is the shower. shared with one other person and the unit pays for all the cleaning supplies so you don't have to buy nothing so my bed looks a little poor because I'm leaving in the morning got rid of everything and the things that I'm leaving behind so and it's time to go so this is so this be me signing off. Okay. So this is the last day tomorrow. I will be on a very long flight to Kuwait. Very long. So I'll start them more, I guess, when I get there. So it's been a long time. Long. I haven't been to the States in 20 months. And for 
course, you can see the furniture here has seen better days. <laughs> there are some MREs we keep in our room just in case things get bad. And there's me, that me. But, uh, so, this is Cullen signing off from Bagram, Afghanistan. Bye, y'all. Well, this is the last day in this room. So, not much left. And it's time to say goodbye. We've been together for a long time. Broken closet. Bags All right, time to go. Bye, room. So finally, after many delays, I think it took us three days to get out, we finally made, we finally got a flight out on the C-17, and that's me inside. I was so happy. Had a couple vehicles inside, in the middle. We finally got to fly out to, to Kuwait. Uh, three days later than originally scheduled, so. And this is beautiful Ali Asaleen. So happy to get there and be out of Afghanistan. Sit down this first time of the year, sit down and have breakfast. It's like safe out of the madness. But you know, kinda did miss the place as soon as I left. Crazy. Here we were waiting for bus transportation to get to Camp Arafjan. It's the last leg of our journey before flying to the States. So, uh, <clears throat> a lot of memories, and I'll do that final part here. Coming up from Camp Arafjan to Camp Atterbury, Indiana will be the last in this series.